I love the Washington Times. I try to read it every morning when I get up. Just great articles as far as opinion pieces. I love this guy Charles Hurt down here. He's always got good stuff on. With that said, here's an article that was uh, posted at the end of January the 31st. I've been hearing it on the news over and over and over again. Florida is poised to become the 26th state that allows permitless carry of guns. Can you believe that in this day and age when Biden is out there trying to destroy gun rights? Old Governor DeSantis here is just uh, pushing it through. And it appears that the Florida lawmakers have the have the votes they have the push we are a red 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 state all the way up senate assembly governor so they are pushing this i'm curious how it's going to end up the house speaker this gentleman by the name of paul renner he is really pushing the effort with support from of course ron DeSantis. we've got a lot of uh, county sheriffs on board as well so, if this law passes, qualified people could carry a concealed weapon without seeking a permit and paying related fees, although they must follow laws prohibiting weapons in places like schools, athletic events, jails, hospitals, uh, every doctor's office you go, they got that sign outside, no concealed weapons, you go for a CAT scan, no concealed weapons. Floridians shouldn't need government permission to slip. A slip, I guess, is a permit. We don't need a permission slip. Like when you go to public school, you need a permission slip to leave early from your parents. Well, we don't need that permission slip to exercise their constitutional rights, Mr. Renner said. People could still seek a permit if they wanted to, and those prohibited from owning a weapon would still be barred. Well, we'll see what happens. With DeSantis coming up as a possible 2024 presidential candidate maybe he wants to get this under his belt um, many red and purple states have passed laws can, allowing for permitless carry over the past decade only a handful of such laws predate 2015 and again Vermont has never enacted a law banning the right to dis discreetly bear arms according to the NRA. This is an interesting article. I'll put it up there, read it, do your little research. Come on down to Florida. Drive these home prices up. I'm looking to bail. I don't know, man. We'll see what happens. Market took a hit yesterday on after hours anyway, on a lot of winners I had. All the tech stuff is down. Apple Amazon, they all got hit pretty hard there on earnings, so we'll see what happens. Hopefully this economy will turn around slowly. All right, I'm out. February 3rd, Friday, got things to do.